back with you. Well, they fired all of their teachers, but now a Hernando County school has nearly all of those positions filled. All new at six, ABC Action News reporter Wendy Lane shows us just how many former teachers are getting their jobs back. Moton Elementary has been a failing school in Hernando County for years. The rating of the school has been horrible since I went here. Denitra Hicks was so fed up with the school. It's been trouble after trouble. She pulled her daughter out of class to homeschool her. I blame the teachers and the administration at Moton Elementary. Hicks attended Moton as a child. She says there are some good teachers here, but she felt something needed to change. Absolutely, to get the bad ones out. I feel like they needed to pink slip them to close the school. But Vince Laberanti, president of the Hernando Classroom Teachers Association, says the way the school district pink slipped all of those teachers broke their contracts. Not a good move. The Teachers Association filed a grievance with the school district and came to an agreement. And we also basically proposed some resolutions as to how we could fix the problem. The tenured teachers who were to be reassigned to a school now have choices between schools in the district. 14 of the pink slip teachers have been rehired at Moton. 11 will come from other schools in the district, while another 11 will be new to Hernando County. The district says they hope to have the other 11 positions filled this month. So are you going to bring your daughter back here next year? Um, once I find out where the teachers are coming from and do background checks, yes. In Hernando County, Wendy Lane. ABC Action News.